Hey there, speed demons and Sunday drivers alike. Ever had that heart-stopping moment when you're merging onto a busy highway? Foot to the floor, but your car just hesitates? Yeah, that's the dreaded delayed throttle response. And today we're diving under the hood to uncover why it happens and how to fix it. Buckle up, because by the end of this video, you'll be accelerating smoothly into the fast lane of car knowledge. What is throttle response? Before we hit the gas on this topic, let's break down what throttle response actually is. It's basically how quickly your car gets moving when you press the pedal. In modern cars, it's like a complex dance between mechanical parts and computer systems. But what happens when this dance gets out of step? Let's find out. The culprits behind the delay. 1. Worn engine components. First up, we've got worn engine components. Imagine trying to run a marathon in old, worn-out shoes. That's what your engine feels like with aging pistons, rings, and bearings. They can lead to poor compression and a serious case of the slows. 2. Clogged fuel system. Next, let's talk about your car's fuel system. Think of it as your car's circulatory system. When it's clogged, your engine is basically gasping for energy. Culprits include dirty injectors, clogged filters, and failing fuel pumps. 3. Sensor malfunctions. Now, onto the electronic side of things. Modern cars are packed with sensors. They're like the eyes and ears of your engine's brain. When these go haywire, your car's computer gets confused, leading to poor performance. 4. Turbocharger lag. For your turbo fans out there, you might be experiencing turbo lag. It's that moment when your turbo is still yawning and stretching before it wakes up to give you that boost. Midroll engagement. Phew. That's a lot of info, right? If you're finding this helpful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Trust me, your car will thank you. Now, let's get back to the good stuff, diagnosing the problem. So, how do you figure out what's causing your throttle delay? Here's your detective toolkit. 1. Listen for unusual noises. 2. Notice when and how the delay occurs. 3. Check for warning lights. 4. Use an OBD2 scanner. Remember, some issues need a pro's touch. Don't be afraid to call on the experts. Solutions to get you moving again. Now for the part you've all been waiting for, the fixes. 1. Clean or replace air filters. First up, let your engine breathe. A clean air filter can work wonders for your throttle response. 2. Fuel system maintenance. Keep that fuel system squeaky clean. Use fuel system cleaners, replace filters, and maybe treat your injectors to a professional cleaning. 3. Sensor TLC. Show those sensors some love. Clean that MEF sensor, replace oxygen sensors if needed, and make sure your throttle body is spick and span. 4. Software updates. Sometimes, the fix is all in the code. Check with your dealership for ECU updates. It's like giving your car a brain upgrade. 5. Professional tuning. For those stubborn cases, professional engine tuning might be the answer. It's like sending your car to the gym with a personal trainer. Preventative measures. An ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure, right? Here's how to keep throttle delay at bay. 1. Stick to your maintenance schedule. 2. Use high-quality fuel. 3. Drive mindfully. No riding the brake while accelerating. Conclusion. And there you have it, folks. From understanding the problem to zooming past it, you're now equipped to tackle throttle delay head-on. Remember, a responsive car isn't just about the thrill. It's about safety, too. Got any throttle response stories or tips of your own? Drop them in the comments below. And if this video helped you out, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more car care content. Until next time, keep those engines purring and those wheels turning.